If a giant, Kama wewe ni shujaa, you must learn. Lazima ujifunze. To escape jokes. Kuacha utani. Because jokes, kwa sababu utani, will bring you down. Utakupeleka chini. Kuna watu walianza kiutani utani. Some people started like a joke. I love you. Nakupenda. Sasa, hajui mimi ni mtumishi wa Mungu. They don't know my servant of God. <laughs> Ashindwe kabisa kwa jina la Yesu. I rebuke him in the name of Jesus. Let me test and see what you say. Unanipendaje wewe? Let me answer and see how do you love me? Mimi nilikuwa nakupenda tu. I just loved you. Nifafanulie. Can you explain? Giant ameanza masayara. The giants started jokes. Can you explain me more? Unaweza ukafafanua? How do you love me? Namna gani unanipenda? Ni kama mshirika mwenza wako, kama Ni kama it's like the member of wewe the church. Wewe na wewe. Don't you understand? Wewe si mtu mzima bwana. You are an elder. What next? Kinachofuata baadaye. It's a fall. Ni anguko. Can I please come and see you? Naweza kuja kukuona? You make as a joke. Unafanya kama utani. Come. Njo. I am free. Ni niko huru na muda. The giant. Huyu ni jitu. <laughs> He is about to fall. Anaelekea kwenye anguko. Sema this time I prove to him that I am born again. Ah this time nitathibitisha kwamba mimi ni mlokole. This time I prove to her that I am born again. Nitathibitisha kwake kwamba mimi nimeokoka. If you are a giant. Kama wewe ni jitu. You must learn. Lazima ujifunze to escape kuacha what we call jokes. Kile tunaita utani. Kuna watu wengi wameanguka kwa sababu ya utani utani. Many people feel Yaani hata mwenye ukimuuliza anakuambia it was it was a joke. Hicho ndo kilimwangusha Samson. This is what took him down. Wewe unipendi. Says you don't love me. Yaani ambia siri yako. You have not told me. Ninaondoka. I'm leaving you. Nakuacha hapo. I'm leaving you. I'm done. Nakamwambia ah. He says no. Sinifanyie hivyo. Don't do that to me bila wewe mimi nakufa without you i'm dying unajua sisi Mungu alituokoa huko you know god said that mimi kubiri hapa imanishi yeye pitia madarasa ya mapenzi na yajua vizuri if i preach here that's not mean i'm not going through the class of now i know it very well ndio mimi nikiona kijana analia kwa ajili ya mapenzi na sasa kijana that's when i see a young man crying for love i say oh una kazi kubwa you have a long way to go mpaka useme until you speak out Samson, walk him up Samson. Oh, the Philistines are coming. Akanyanyuka. So he grows. Akasema wako wapi? Where are they? The Philistines walipita walipotokea. The Philistines wakatafuta njia ya kutokea, wakakimbia. They ran away. Akamwambia, he said now. Hii ndio umedhibitisha kabisa. Now you have confirmed completely beyond this doubt. Now please tell me. Yanguvu zako. The source Mali of your power. Sana. So the Bible say she cried a lot. Akamwambia. Now he said. Unaona sinywele? You see this air? Tangu tumboni kwa mama yangu. From my mother's womb mpaka sasa. To date sijawahi kunyolewa. I've never cut them short. Ukifanikiwa kuzinywa hizi nywele. If you can manage to do that. Umefanikiwa kuzipata nguvu sana. You have taken my power. Akamwambia ndio hilo tu. He said that so. Darasa la kubembeleza likarudi. Now the class Nataka ujue dada alifanya kazi ngumu sana kuhakikisha mwanaume jamaa la vita linalala. I want to know that this sister did a very difficult job to make sure he's making it. So he lua him again. Akahakikisha anakoroma. She made sure he was fast asleep. So he cut short all the air. Alafu akamwambia Philistine ingie. See the Philistines come in. The Samson. Wa Philistia. The Philistines are coming. Maandiko yanasema Samson akasema. The Bible says Samson said nitasimama. I will stand majana as yesterday I choose and day before Ili yesterday the moment is raising empty. he found himself without any power dambi dambi inaweza kusababisha sin can cause you kapungukiwa na nguvu za kiroho to have a decrease of spiritual powers ndolewa nguvu za kiroho kabisa or all spiritual powers to be removed akajikuta ni mkavu he found himself dry wakasema baba this is now man yero Yero, you have tortured us a long time. Sasa uko kwenye mikono yako. Now you are in your hands. Cha kwanza. The first. Wakatobayo macho. The pok. Samson akawa kipofu. Samson became blind. Wakaanza kumfanyia wanavyotaka. They started now to do jokes with him. Tochotaka. What if they want to do? Ikafika mahali hadi kwenye maonyesho wanafanya maonyesho wanamleta na Samson katikati wanambia Leteni Samson. They bring Samson in the show. Ajiacheze bring Samson to come and dance to us Samson cheza Samson dance cheza usiogope usiogope Samson dance Samson 
kuna watu wengi hapa many people here shetani aliziona nguvu mlizonazo alichokifanya haraka what he did quickly akatengeneza mfumo created a system wa dhambi a system of sin kwa mfumo huo by that system anasnyanya nguvu you suck out your powers hata ukinyanyua sema fire and you will raise and say fire ni kweli sauti unatoa truly you have the voice lakini utoi mamlaka but there's no authority it is possible to shout inawezekana kupiga kelele without authority bila kuwa na mamlaka tell your neighbor it is possible to shout tell your neighbor it is possible to shout without authority without authority inawezekana ukapaza sauti it is possible for you to shout lakini but hivi unajua ulimwengu wa roho hauwe respond sauti in a spiritual realm ulimwengu wa roho una respond mamlaka the spiritual realm responds to authority kama ambavyo mtoto as a child unapomkemea when rebuke a child respond to sauti uliyoitoa the respond respond in nafasi yako kama baba is responding to a position as a father as a mother ndivyo ilivyo katika roho neno maana mtoto unayemkemea this is the child the rebuke alafu akawa na hasira na wewe and becoming angry ni mtoto ambaye hajui mamlaka yako that the child who does not know your authority kinachomuadabisha mtoto wako what makes si tu sauti unayopiga not no, no. your voice ni authority ulionayo ni mamlaka is authority you have you can shout you can talk about kelele without authority pasipokuwa na mamlaka so adui anachofanya haraka nini so the enemy does quickly akikona wewe ni msumbufu when you see you are troublesome when you go in the clan ni msumbufu you are troublesome ndani ya kanisa in the church ni msumbufu you are troublesome na una nguvu za kiroho and you spirit of power he said ya kuna namna nyingine jamaa lazima tumtengenezeza we must do something great kwa kweli zambi itakuwa kwake kama kitanzu this sin will be like a pain in the neck hicho ndio walichofanya kwa samson this is what he did to samson kuna watu kuna vitu mkiviacha there are things if you leave them namna mtakavyotembea the way shall walk dunia itajua nyenye ni kina nani kuna watu kuna vitu mkiviacha when you live something nana tayari otembea ulimwengu utaona lakini shetani anajua nguvu mlizonazo your power ni kubwa is great lakini namna ya kuwateka na kuwanyang'anya na vitu mlivyo but the way to arrest you and grab all the things you have it create a system of sin and tengeneza mfumo wa dhambi sin dhambi is a way ni njia to reduce ya kupunguza spiritual power nguvu za kiroho au to remove you become unakuwa mkavu 